Ever imagined the sun throwing a tantrum? Well, that's kind of what's happening in 2025. Our star is entering the solar maximum, the most active phase of its 11-year cycle, and things are about to get intense. During this time, the sun starts firing solar flares massive bursts of radiation and energy caused by the sudden release of magnetic pressure. Think of it like space fireworks but with real-world impact. These flares can travel at light speed and hit Earth in just 8 minutes. And when they do, they can disrupt satellites, GPS systems, radio signals, and even power grids. Now, here's the wild part. Scientists say that 2025 could see some of the strongest solar activity in over a decade. The number of sunspots is rising fast, which means the sun is building up more and more magnetic energy ready to explode. More sunspots mean more chances of flares. It's like the sun is having mood swings and Earth's tech might just feel the heat. You've probably heard of solar storms before, but this year they're not just science fiction, they're real. In fact, agencies like NASA and NOAA are closely monitoring space weather, warning industries like aviation, power, and communications to stay alert. SpaceX satellite companies, airlines, they're all watching the sun like it's their ex on Instagram stories. Why does it matter? Let's rewind to 1859 the Carrington event. A massive solar flare hit Earth and caused telegraph systems to go haywire. Some even caught fire. Now imagine something like that today. With our dependency on electronics, the damage could be worth trillions. Your Wi-Fi going down. Just the start. Full-blown satellite outages. Possible. But hey, it's not all doom and gloom. Solar flares also bring beauty. When those charged particles hit Earth's magnetic field, they create stunning auroras not just in the Arctic but possibly in places that usually never see them. So yeah, a solar storm could light up your sky like a cosmic rave. People in New York or Delhi might just catch a glimpse of that northern light magic. Should you panic? Nah, Earth's magnetic field is like a shield that protects us from most of the harmful radiation. But being aware is smart, especially if you rely on satellite-based services or live in high-latitude areas. Even astronauts on the ISS take shelter during strong solar flare warnings. It's real enough for space agencies to stay on high alert. So, what can we expect? More frequent solar flares, a higher chance of radio blackouts, stronger auroras, possible GPS glitches, and yes, those random your signal is weak moments that aren't just your network's fault. The sun is getting louder in 2025 and we're right in the middle of the show. Stay tuned because space isn't quiet anymore. And if you're into science, space weather, or just love staring at the sky wondering what the sun is up to this is your time. Follow for more updates because the sun's not done yet.